friends, welcome to Ansel. So today it is the 52nd episode in the space series. So today we are going to discuss about another space probe that is known as Juno. Yes, so Juno is a NASA space probe that is presently orbiting around the planet Jupiter. Yes. So it was built by the Lockheed Martin company and is presently operated by NASA's Jet Propulsion Laboratory. Yes. So yeah. you know it's pretty special so it was this one it was the second um, second space probe to ever orbit jupiter yes so it was launched from cape canaveral air force station on august 5th 2011 yes that was 10 years ago Tw- i mean 12 years ago that's a very long time ago yes So after completing its mission, Juno will be intentionally deorbited into Jupiter's atmosphere. So first it was planned that it, that will happen on 2018, but then it was perfectly delayed to 2025. Yes. So that means in 2025, finally Juno will stop orbiting in Jupiter and instead of going into another planet, it will ouch. Yes, it will go into the Ju- gas atmosphere of jupiter yes so yeah juno's mission is to measure jupiter's composition like the uh, amount of helium what gases are inside the atmosphere then the gravitational field of jupiter the magnetic field of jupiter as well as the polar magnetosphere of jupiter itself yes so it has many jobs to do in this planet yes So it is the second spacecraft to orbit Jupiter after the nuclear powered Galileo orbiter. Yes. So Juno is powered by solar panels while this sole Galileo was powered by nuclear energy. Yes. So while Juno is completely renewable energy. Yes, eco-friendly but it it is in space. Yes, there's no pollution in space. So Juno's name comes from the Greek in roman mythology so juno in roman mythology is the wife of jupiter the god jupiter yes so yeah juno is also called as the new frontiers 2 yes so like new frontiers is just a series of many spacecrafts the example the series rex and then in the new horizons so new horizons for the first one next the second one is juno yes So yeah next it completed its first flyby of Jupiter on August 26 2016 and captured the first images of the planet's north pole yes so to, that means it was close to getting in orbit yes inside Jupiter's orbit so Juno also examines the Jupiter's inner moons Ganymede and Europa and Io yes so it also observed the inner moons of Jupiter too and finally the main missions the juno needs to do so first juno needs to determine the ratio of oxygen and hydrogen on uh, jupiter like hydrogen is this much on jupiter and oxygen is this much on jupiter yes like that so next it let's estimate the jupiter's core mass if there is a core of a jupiter then it will uh, try to calculate the mass of that core inside of jupiter if there is even a core first Yes next it will try to map Jupiter's gravitational field how long it stretches for like that and finally it will also try to map the Jupiter's magnetic field yes how big it stretches for is it actually does it stretch for stretch to Saturn's orbit like that yes so these are the main objectives of Juno as well yes so this is for today about Juno bye